Is that awkward enough? What's up, guys? What's up, Alex? What's up? What's the word, man? What do we got going on? Well, I think we figured this trailer might be uh, kind of a loss. I think you know a couple guys at Pacific uh, Trailers, so I think we could be a little upgrade today for the boat. What do you think? I'm down. Let's do it. So yeah, we're gonna throw this thing uh, in the back of the truck, drive it up to Pacific Trailers. Have the boys fabricate a, a custom safe trailer for this thing so we can uh, take it all over town. I think we're just gonna chuck it in the back of the truck and see if we make it there like the old days. Maybe a couple rat straps, try to beat the rain. You guys okay? One to 10 scale, how safe are we right now? Uh, I'd say we got a solid three going. Nice hat. Thanks, man. Matches your jacket. I got it from uh, these guys at Big Bass Dreams. I don't know. Yeah, don't trust them. You seem all right. Yo, so my name is Luis. I'm the operations and sales manager at Pacific. This is Tony, our service manager, and Steve, our service tech. How's it going? Um, kind of the, the men behind the, the mission over here. Mm -hmm. Word on the street is Big Steve used to do work on Clear Lake. All the time, man. I grew up <laughs> out there <laughs> fishing the sluice. Yeah. <laughs> Look at it, we got Mr. Pellerito. This is a service trailer yeah. to keep on hand for the people that don't have trailers. Yeah, it does look super high. <laughs> It'll be the first time you rolled one. <laughs> you guys flipped it up for the second. Yeah. Oh, the, <laughs> the little the OG one. Because yeah. my, my wheelbase is like where the bunks were. Uh -huh. Like they were like, super like the narrow, right dude. Now. But it worse. Was, yeah, but it, it just, was worse. I don't know it how could, I never wrecked it. I mean, you come in a corner and just be like, perm. Side. Both sides of the boat had scratches on it from slide down the highway. Hey, it never sunk, it always held up. Oh, look, that's Toyota. Holla. Perfect. So, we're gonna putting this Gregor 13 on our 14 1200. It is a galvanized single axle trailer rated up to 1200 pounds. Um, essentially, it's just gonna be a two axle or two cross member trailer, single axle. Um, it'll have sealed bearings, sealed lighting, sealed harness, and it'll be custom fit to the boat. Um, what you see right now is going to be a complete transformation once it's done. all over the world you're everywhere essentially mainly within the states um, and this is kind of where it all starts right here we have a full service department so we can help all of wherever the guys are that want to come in here for any type of services right on um, front to back whether it's refitment what we're doing on here or as simple as wheel bearings like we did on Oliver's trailer and getting the lights working gotcha we do galvanized steel and then we also do aluminum and aluminum we do an i-beam and then a steel channel okay the i-beam is what we're going to call our economy model okay really there's no huge price difference from that to our galvanized essentially it's made to just we can make that trailer and ship it to the east coast yeah and a guy can fit it on there and adjust it himself no issues gotcha we have an aluminum c channel which is our high-end model that's a full welded construction yep. custom fit to any boat that you might bring to us where we have documentation on it 
um, and that's going to be our high end. And then our galvanized is kind of what we've been doing for 40 years. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, kind of our bread and butter right there. So I was telling Oliver yesterday, we can do what we call a custom fit trailer, but still pull off our stock frames. Gotcha. You know what I mean? So you have like a base model that's adjustable exactly. to what so you guys need. Over the 40 years that Pacific's been in business, you know, people have taken all the documentation on boats that we do yeah. trailers for. And you can call me. I got a you know Grady White 330, which is a huge boat, obviously. Yeah. You know, 33 feet, 20,000 pounds, yep. and we can custom fit it without ever having your boat here. Oh, that's perfect. You know, and yeah. Essentially, we don't even have to make a special frame because it's right here in the back. Yep. All that's custom is the parts that go onto that trailer after. Gotcha. Okay. Huh. So you guys pretty much have the capacity to do everything in the house then that you guys need to do. Just about, yeah. We won't. I mean, as far as like brake parts and axles, that is something that we do use UFP for. Okay. Um, outside of that, everything's produced in here, man. Oh, that's From awesome. The frames, the fenders. Made in America. Yeah, everything. Everything. Even the steel that we purchased has been in American steel oh, since, awesome. since I've started here, as far as I know. Um, in here is actually where everything kind of creates before it hits either that yard, yep. the stock frames, or it goes to a truck for a custom frame. Okay. See how there's already risers on there? Yeah. Um, to the galvanizer. This is where everything starts. And then from here, it goes to the assembly line. Really fabricated house. From there, it goes to that gate where you guys kind of walked in this morning. Oh, that's awesome. What you think, man? I think it's pretty cool uh, operation they got here. American made, quality quality equipment. I think it'll be a uh, be all around good time. A little safer on those long road trips too, so I think it'll be good. But uh, yeah, Pacific boat trailers, man, it's a real deal. Best part is they're rad dudes. Yeah, every here is cool, down to earth, like. You know, one of the boys, so it's, it's cool. I, I think it'll be a good fit for us. Yeah, they're pumped for this project probably more than we are. I think just as much. That's not true. I think the Kronos probably the best all around. What do I do with it?